This is the second exam of 803. My lectures on videotape are from the fall of 2004. We again, we give students equations because nothing is to be gained. Ridiculous even to remember <laughs> complex equations like this. What counts is that you have to know when to apply them and how to apply them. No one remembers these equations, certainly I don't. But the notion that if you have the equation you can solve a problem, which is a typical high school idea, is a totally wrong. With all these equations that you see here, you couldn't solve any of the problems of this exam, unless you have a complete understanding of these equations. And it is the power of my <laughs> lectures that I make people see through the equations. And that's a way to make them understand the equations. Oh, Doppler effect. Yeah, that, that has the time dilation also in it. Because 1 over the square root of 1 minus beta square is gamma. Euler's equation is, in one, is for me the most spectacular equation of all of math. Because it means that e to the power j times pi, e to the power j pi is minus 1. Isn't that wonderful? e to the power j pi is minus 1. All right, so here's the exam. Oh, this was one of my physics problems on my YouTube channel. And here are the solutions of the second exam. Phase velocities, group velocities.
I believe this was an example of total reflection. <laughs>